The Chronicles of Narnia, a double book review. Monkey Vader, ahi, ahi. What's up, monkey fans? Today I'm going to do a double book review of book one and two of The Chronicles of Narnia, or book zero and one. This is basically, this is basically zero and one because this one's like before this one, which I think the other ones have the characters in this one, but this one doesn't have the characters. I don't know, it's confusing. Only one character actually is in this one, which is the perfect, which is Diggory, who becomes the professor in this one. Anyway, let's get started on my book review. I have a little book notepad thingy. So it says the title of the book, The Magician's Nest, nephew author is cs dot lewis is the author i started this on the 8th the 20 the 8th the september 25th 2020 2020 i rated it four stars wait, wait you started september 25th 2020 whoa you were you went in the future because it's only september 17th and now and you you did it says your eight oh August 25th. Because it was oh, before we left I'm for all like, the filming. <laughs> what? I read this in the future? Oh, man. It doesn't say a date when I finished it. The main characters are the witch, Uncle Andrew, Diggory, Polly, Asland, and the cabbie, and his wife. I only put a, put a very small summary, so I'm gonna have to go back for my But memory. you said there was only one character from that book to the other book, and Asland yeah. is in the other book. <laughs> Two. <laughs> if I didn't realize I need Aslan. to make a blooper reel. <laughs> yeah, I do need to make a blooper reel. That's funny. Let's restart this and add this to a blooper. The whole thing? No, the where I'm where I'm saying the author. Nah, just go. Okay, just cut it. <clears throat> nah. Cut. Okay, now action. The you author, forgot to say quiet on the set. Quiet on the set! Action! C. S. Lewis is the author. I started this on the August 25th, 2020. I rated it four stars. It was way better than this book. I mean, way less better. Than, this book's way better. Anyway, their main character is Witch, Uncle Andrew, Diggory, Polly, Aslan, and the cabbie. There's two characters from this book to go into this book. The book is about how Narnia is formed and it's not exact, it's like, that's just a really brief summary. It's like, that's like half the book. So Diggory, I know, so Diggory and Polly meet outside. So, and they want to explore the, the empty room. Wait, no, that's in the other. They want to explore the empty house in their little terrid, whatever it's called, their little house that's like, they have the same house, but it's like different house. Like an apartment? Isn't it called a flat? No, it's called a t something with a T. Oh, okay. Okay. And <clears throat> why do I need this open? I'm not even reading the summary from the book the review thing. So they, they want to explore what's in the empty. Sorry about all the wobbliness. Yeah. We, they I'm want trying to, to uh, itch my thumb with my tooth. <laughs> <laughs> they tried to. Um, they want to explore the, the other empty house, but they go into the wrong door. And they meet Uncle Andrew into the study. Uncle Andrew tri tricks Polly into, into, touching the, is into touching the yellow ring and have it around her finger. Then uh, she just... Poof! Disappears. Diggory goes. Diggory touches the ring, brings the two green rings with him to, to bring her back. They they realize that there's pools. There's in each pool is a different dimension. So they go into one pool and they get brought into the world of charm. And then later they accidentally bring back Queen Jadis, or if you want to call her the witch. Or wait, no, 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 no. We we rewind. Queen Jadis, she's called the witch, though. She's actually a witch. So anyway, so she gets brought back to Britain. Was it Britain or England they were in? I think it's Britain, not England. Whatever. I think that's, like, the same thing. <laughs> Britain's in England. Great Britain is, 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 England is in Great Britain. Oh, I'm funny. <laughs> 
They're not, I don't, I'm confused. <clears throat> it's okay, it, it confuses me too because I don't pay attention to England much, except their TV, their telly. <laughs> okay, well, wherever they are, they bring them back. Mercedes, England is in Great Britain, correct? Or is, Okay, England is Great Britain. If Britain is part of the UK, because I think Scottish was once, or Scotland was once part of the UK. And then Braveheart happened? What's Braveheart? <laughs> I think uh, the Scottish were like, hmm, screw this, we're going to be on our own now. And then it was something else. Yeah, something like that. Okay, anyway. Cut. Nah, we're just going to leave this in. Cut. Okay. I mean, action. We're okay. going to put this in the book for you. Action. Quiet on the set. Action. Okay. So, um, Brit Britain, they live in Britain. That's They either live in Britain or England. They bring Queen Jadis back to wherever they live. And she kind of causes a ruckus. <laughs> she wants Uncle Andrew to gather her slaves because <laughs> she doesn't understand how the world works. <laughs> okay, so she doesn't understand how the world works. So then they, and then they want to, Diggory and Polly want to get out of it, but the Queen Jadis is, is holding on Diggory's shoulder and Diggory's holding onto Polly's arm and on <laughs> Queen Jadis' other hand is holding on to the cavi and Polly is holding on to Uncle Andrew for some reason. I don't remember I think so. There was that was a month ago I read it. That's what I think that's what I think I remember happened. Anyway, so they go and so they decide to jump into the pool. They jump they all jump into a, a different pool and they're <clears throat> Bring into utter darkness, and then they start hearing voices singing. They realize it's stars, but then they realize Aslan the lion is making it happen. And then, and then what I imagined is that there's the darkness. There's just animals, and and Aslan's like, "You will talk. You will talk. You will talk. You will talk. You will talk." And then some of the animals talk, including the cabbie's horse, Strawberry. And then I guess Narnia is formed. So since the witch is in the land, Aslan's like, hey, Diggory, go get a apple from the whatever, whatever the very, very descriptive words were. And so Diggory has to get on Strawberry, and they fly. They fly. Okay, they fly. They fly over there. The witch is there. The witch tries to <laughs> tempt him. I don't know why I did that. They tried to tempt him. He tried to tempt him. She, bleh, she tried to tempt him to eat the apple or bring it back home to his mother. Degree gets tempted, but he decides to actually go back to and bring it back. He plants the tree. Wait, Aslan Prince pr plants the tree and gives Diggory one and lets him bring it home. She, he feeds the mother. He takes the mother. His, his sick, very, 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 very sick mother. He take, he gives her the apple. He takes the seeds. He plants the seeds. Grows a big apple tree. Then he becomes, um, well, wait. What did he become? What was that thing? I forgot the name. I'm going to go look. What is the name? He becomes, it was the other page, wasn't it? A professor. And 
and that goes into the next book. He builds, he, they move, his family moves into a mansion before he becomes a professor. He uses the wood to build a wardrobe, which goes into the next book, The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. They, the Ketterly family, why am I looking through the book? So, the Ketterly family gets the, did I not, what happened to the other one? I think I skipped a page on accident. So it goes in the line, the witch of the wardrobe, same author, main characters, which Queen J slash Queen Jadis, Lucy, Peter, Edmund, and Susan in Aslan. They go into the wardrobe, which brings them immediately to Narnia. Okay, let me, let me, let me rewind. Lucy decides to go into the wardrobe for some reason. I don't know. Wait, why did she go into the wardrobe? Why did she do that? Would, were they playing hide and seek or something? You can watch the movie tomorrow. Yep. <clears throat> Tree goes like, that's my tunnel. Why are these little kittens playing in my tunnel? They were. They decided to explore the empty room. Lucy decides to explore the wardrobe. She goes to um, Aslan, Narnia. She meets this goat human. I forgot his name started with a T, I think. Whatever his name was, Tedmund or something. Tedmund. That's, um, what was? Anyway, continue. Tedmund. The goat. It's a, it's a fawn. Fawn, not goat. Mr. Tummins. Mr. Tummins, that's his name. So he went, she went, she met Mr. Tummins. Mr. Tummins cries about him being a bad goat. Yada, yada about the queen thingy, thingy, mingy, yuck. Capture humans, son of Adams and daughter of Eve's. I don't know what that is. I don't know what, who they, what they are. I guess they're humans. I don't know. All I know is that cats rock, and I have a cat right here. Okay. Anyway, so that so then Lucy tells everyone her story. Next day, it's a rainy day. They play hide and seek because they're bored. So Lucy wants to explore Narnia again, and Edmund just goes into the wardrobe just to tease her. And then Ed, and then Edmund goes to Narnia. He he meets Queen Jadis, who is supposed to, supposedly Queen of Narnia, not really. And so he makes a deal with her that he will bring the brother, his brothers and sisters, back with him. Him and he will get more Turkish delight, which I thought Turkish delight was a meat at first. And I was like, why is the meat sweet? Because he said, ooh, this Turkish delight is so sweet. And I'm like, why is meat sweet? I was very confused until after I read the book, mommy looked it up and I found out it was can. It was some sort of confection. Well, I stuff. told you what it was, but then I just showed you. I, I already knew what it was. I was very confused. I thought it was meat. Cause like, seriously. My meat. I would meet. So next, all the kids go into the. They. Wait, what happened again? The Turkish delight. No, I would. Now they. Now it's where all the kids went in the wardrobe. Oh. And they started exploring a badger thing, a beaver, not a badger. Wait, what's the difference? I'm confused. Beaver meets them and then they go to meet Aslan while later Edmund sneaks away to go to the witch talks that Aslan man Aslan is coming and and then the witch yells at him is like why have you brought me all alone and then he's like but Aslan is coming Aslan and the witch is like Land. So they get on the slave sledge, whatever it's called, 
and they go to the stone table. That's where they're heading. They, they meet, then the witch is too late. They meet Aslan, the Aslan, Aslan Combs. And as, so Aslan decides they go to the stone, the, not the, the palace, all the stone statues Aslan lets free. And then they have a big battle and the witch dies. Aslan killed her. That was my book review of The Lion, the Witch, and the Werewolf and The Magician's Nephew. Chronicles of Narnia, a double book review by 